President Donald Trump gave a press conference at Trump Tower in New York City Tuesday afternoon that quickly went off the rails after reporters questioned his official response to the violence at the Unite the Right rally in Charlottesville, Virginia on Saturday, which left one dead and many more injured. Trump pinned blame for the violence in Charlottesville on many sides while declining to specifically condemn white nationalists in his initial statement on Saturday. After widespread criticism, Trump made a second statement Monday, denouncing neo-Nazis and KKK members as repugnant and specifically calling out the hatred and bigotry shown at the rally. On Tuesday afternoon, however, Trump doubled down on his assertion that the violence was caused by bad actors on both sides during a press conference ostensibly about infrastructure. Trump equated what he called the alt left with the alt right at the rally, and said that not all those participating in the rally were neo Nazis or white supremacists. Trump's new chief of staff, John Kelly, who was brought in to help discipline the White House, looked especially displeased with how the press conference panned out. Kirsten Donnelly, an NBC News reporter, has the photo John Kelly during the president's Q&A at Trump Tower pic.twitter.com 3 to K3, Kristen Donnelly at Christine Donnelly August 15, 2017 site highlights each day to your inbox. Follow Business Insider Australia on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram.